The 30th Space Wing 30 SW, is an Air Force wing forming a subordinate unit of the 14th Air Force of the Air Force Space Command of the United States Air Force. The 30th Space Wing is based at Vandenberg Air Force Base, California. The 30 SW is the Air Force Space Command organization responsible for all Department of Defense space and missile launch activities on the West Coast. All U.S. satellites destined for near-polar orbit are launched from Vandenberg. Topic. Overview The wing supports West Coast launch activities for the Air Force, Department of Defense, National Aeronautics and Space Administration, and various private industry contractors. The wing launches a variety of expendable vehicles including the Delta II, Pegasus, Taurus, Atlas, Titan II and Titan IV. The wing also supports force development and evaluation of all intercontinental ballistic missiles. The 30th SW is home to the Western Range and manages Department of Defense space and missile testing, and placing satellites into near-polar orbit from the West Coast, using expendable boosters, Delta II, Atlas, Titan II and Titan IV. Wing personnel also support the services Minuteman III and Peacekeeper Intercontinental Ballistic Missile follow-on operational test and evaluation launch program. The western range begins at the coastal boundaries of Vandenberg and extends westward from the California coast to the western Pacific including sites in Hawaii. Operations there involve dozens of federal and commercial interests. The western range is operated by the 2nd Range Operations Squadron and maintained by the 30th Range Management Squadron. It is a vast tracking, telemetry, and command complex whose boundary begins along Vandenberg's California coastline and extends westward across the Pacific Ocean. The range consists of electronic and optical tracking systems located along the Pacific coast that collect and process launch-related data for a variety of users. Topic. Units. Additionally, the 30th Controller Squadron 30 CPTS, reports directly to the Wing Commander. Topic. History For additional history and lineage, see 30th Operations Group. Topic. Lineage Established as Air Force Western Test Range, and activated, on 5 May 1964 organized on 15 May 1964. Inactivated on 1 April 1970 redesignated Western Space and Missile Center, and activated, on 1 October 1979 redesignated 30 Space Wing on 19 November 1991. Topic. Assignments Air Force Systems Command, 5 May 1964 National Range Division, 15 May 1964 to 1 April 1970 Space and Missile Test Organization, 1 October 1979 Space Systems Division, 1 October 1989 9th Space Division, 1 October 1990 Air Force Space Command, 1 October 1991 14th Air Force, 20 September 1993-present Topic. Components Groups 30 operations, the 19th of November 1991 present. 30 launch, the 1st of December 2003 present. 6,595 missile test later, 6,595 test and evaluation, the 1st of October 1979 to the 1st of October 1990. 
6,595 satellite test later, 6,595 aerospace test, the 1st of October 1979 to the 1st of October 1990. 6,595 shuttle test, the 1st of October 1979 to the 31st of January 1987. Topic: Stations. Vandenberg Air Force Base, California, the 15th of May 1964 to the 1st of April 1970, the 1st of October 1979 present. Topic: Aircraft and missiles. Topic: Operations. Upon activation in 1964 the future 30th SW operated and maintained the Western Test Range. The 30th conducted strategic missile test programs, including Minuteman Force Reliability Assessment and Peacekeeper Flight Development efforts. The wing maintained launch and support facilities for the Space Shuttle from 1984 to 1987. It conducted other aerospace systems launching and tracking operations at the California launch site and at several fixed and mobile instrumentation sites in the Pacific. The 30th also provided support personnel to USAF units deployed to Southwest Asia from August 1990 to April 1991, and to Saudi Arabia on a rotational basis thereafter. Most recently it has also deployed personnel in support of Operation Enduring Freedom and Operation Iraqi Freedom. Topic. Delta IV for NRO On 20 January 2011, the 30th Space Wing and their commercial partners successfully launched a United Launch Alliance Delta IV heavy rocket into space from Vandenberg AFB, Calif. This was the first ever West Coast launch of the Delta IV heavy. The 235-foot-tall launch vehicle, the largest ever fired from the U.S. West Coast, carried a classified U.S. intelligence satellite, USA-224, aloft for the atop-secret National Reconnaissance Office. 